Scorpio. What's popping water, babies? What is going on in the life of a Scorpio for the month of August? I apologize for being tardy to the party. Shit, I had to get me right, okay? Because if I ain't right, I can't get nobody else right. So I apologize. Much, much respect to everybody and love to everybody who's shown me so much love. Um, just really recently in the past, like, things are evolving and growing for me. And I just, I couldn't do it without you guys. So thank you so much, familia, for coming through, showing up, and showing out for the kid. Do you understand me? Thank you. Also, this will definitely be for the sun, moon, rising, as well as Venus um, and the cross watchers for the sun sign of Scorpio. This will be from today into the 15th of August, 2018, and I will be back on time. That is my guarantee for the mid months. OK, this is just a general reading. It's not personal. If you need a personal, that information can be found within the description. Also, check that breaking news video out because I do have reading specials. I'm going to make another video today. So I'm going to extend my reading specials because, of course, everybody else, a lot of us are late tardy to the party. OK, so <laughs> Scorpio, this one is for you. All right. I love y'all so very much. This fiery energy I feel from y'all right now. My feet are on fire. Literally, a lot of y'all are breaking bad, literally. Okay, Scorpio. So I'm going to start off with a Crystal Angels Oracle Cards um, angel message from Doreen Virtue. If I stutter, stu, 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 stay with me. Mercury retrograde is on my ass. I have Libra and Gemini and Pisces and Aries in my chart. So it's going down with between my air and my fire, but this water is just all over the place, okay? All the love. I may cry, I may not. Just depend on what the hell these damn cards say. Y'all know I'm a cuss. I'm beyond that. Oh, to all my new subscribers, welcome to the family. We cuss. I cut, we cuss a lot. That's why y'all resonate with me because I'm 100. I'm coming to you with authenticity. Y'all can feel me, Scorpio. Y'all love that. Y'all see, I'm transparent. Y'all, y'all see smooth through my ass, which is why we be here. Okay, so with the, with the messages that I have for you intuitively, I feel that you're having to make a decision and you're choosing love over loyalty. And it's a hell of a decision, but you have to do what's best for you. OK, baby. And 222 two, two just flashed across my screen. It is going to bring your life balance. Some of y'all that met y'all match. OK, after possibly leaving somebody who was also your damn match. So you don't know who going to like this match. And let me get some fire under your ass. All right. So let's get it. Scorpio. The message I have for y'all is aquamarine. Okay, it says divine life purpose, trust the signs and your inner guidance which are leading you to fulfillment. And this card appears in answer, I'm sorry, in answer to questions about your next step, your career or spiritual path and your life purpose. Your purpose like everyone else's is to love. The form that you choose to express love needs to be based upon what you love to do. For example, do you enjoy writing, counseling your friends, being with animals in nature, cooking, artistry, teaching children, doing healing work, or conducting research? Following your heart will lead you in the right directions. Yes, you may need to use your head to do some planning and partner up with others who have strengths, complementary to your own. God and your guardian angels are reassuring you that the love that you feel is a sign that this path of action is your life purpose. Okay, so don't doubt your past. Scorpio, Pat. Scorpios are very intuitive. What you feel the first time, what the hell you felt the first time is usually the right way to go. Okay? It don't matter how long you've known people. How do they make you feel? One thing about Scorpio, y'all, never forget two things. How a person treated you. Okay? And what they said and how they made you feel. Y'all hold on to that. You know, and right now, spirit is needed for a lot of y'all to forgive. A lot of y'all are moving past the forgiveness phase. Y'all, you ready to just Quit crying over spilled milk, okay? And just move passionately for the things that make you happy. And that is what spirit is supporting right now. It's in your favor, baby. Mars is back, honey. And we ain't playing no motherfucking games. How about that? All right? So some of y'all, y'all might have had too much coffee and a donut. Look, don't do not do it, all right? Because I've been trying to work it out because I'm going on the road. I'm going to start having some pop-up parties at y'all local malls. I'm Trying to put that in the works, okay? Because I'm ready to get out of Texas. This booty got to get on duty in another city, honey, okay? Let's get it. So, a lot of y'all Scorpios could possibly be dealing with an earth sign, okay? But for those Scorpios who have been going through financial hardship or things of that nature or coming out of that place, a lot of y'all 444, just as I'm talking about the finances, baby, stability is a coming, honey. But some of y'all could be dealing with an earth sign, okay? This could be possibly a younger woman, okay? She could be... 
anywhere between 20 and 45 okay but this woman to me she's abundant okay she's flourishing beautifully a lot of y'all may spend a lot of um, the month of the first half of august in nature a lot of y'all are going to be receiving a lot of downloads during this time in nature y'all third eye is wide open which is why i told y'all i'm very transparent to y'all ass i'm like an open book if you ask i tell you all right now you may not want to hear every damn thing but i told you all right you heard it you hear from the horse's mouth and a lot of y'all mars is back home it needs to come from the horse's mouth. Speak your truths. Can't nobody live in them or for that matter, can't nobody live in no type of, what's the word I'm looking for? Ain't no fucking errors in your truth. Your truth is your truth. It ain't nobody else's truth or path to walk. It's yours. And for some of y'all, most of y'all I'm hearing, it is very narrow. Everybody can't go. What you want to do? It's about you. You put everybody first. Most of y'all people don't even acknowledge the fact that y'all are very loving. Yes, y'all may not be very transparent with your feelings, even though you see clean through other motherfuckers, but I feel like with this earth sign, for those of you strongly dealing with earth, first off, this person could also be pregnant and bringing a child into the world. Congratulations, because Mocha loves the kids, okay? However, I do feel like some of y'all truly love somebody, as well as some of y'all are building a family with somebody. Could also be a air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, okay? Some of y'all are having to make a decision, because I feel like some of y'all didn't match y'all damn match, all right? But some of y'all are needing to communicate, okay? Communicate passionately. Everybody ain't going to like what the hell you have to say. This convicted in your truth. You're sure about it. Whatever this download is that you're going to be receiving in nature... You're going to move forward, Leona, and you're going to communicate what it is that you're passionate about the first half of August. And everybody not going to like it. Two tears in a bucket. Fuck it. Fuck them. You know me, I Same OG. Ain't nobody going to do that for people, okay? Definitely. Some of y'all feel like have met your match. Some of y'all have met somebody who balances you, okay? Or maybe you were dealing with the fire sign. You have an issue with choosing between the fire sign and the air sign. And this air sign makes you feel... The beauty, even it's Virgo, or uh, I feel strong Virgo with that, but it could be Capricorn, or is this Earth sign? This person could make you feel very beautiful, okay? Or maybe some of y'all are starting to see your own beauty, okay? Some of y'all are starting to see the beauty within yourself, and it's making you want to create something attainable in a material way. You know, it's making you want to create, whether you're a painter, whether you're a singer, whether you're a rapper, whether you are any any form of artistry right now, the energies are supporting you. What are you passionate about? Any forms of love, self-love, love for another person, love for what it is that you truly love, okay? Loyalty over love in some situations, okay? Um, or love over loyalty, whatever you choose, but you're having to make heart over head decisions, and that's an uncomfortable space for my big Scorpios, okay? So I want y'all to get out of that energy. A lot of y'all from this during this time are going to get out of that energy of crying over spilled milk. Some of y'all are going to move forward and definitely communicate. You're going, some of y'all are going towards the fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sag, and you're going to communicate, yeah, this may have happened in the past, but some of y'all is having to do with the child. Yes, this may have happened in the past, okay, but I want to move forward. Even if it means we're still being friends, this is my happiness. This is what I have to compromise with this, with, with making peace with you. And it's take it or leave it because this is what I have. But I'm going to be, I'm going to chase what it is that I'm passionate about. Some of y'all could definitely be dealing with an Aries as well. I say that, y'all, because I got my info card right here for y'all. All right, Spirit, please give me the arguments. Act clear and accurate messages for the sun sign of Sagittarius from now until August the 15th, 2018. Some of y'all are definitely going to be communicating possibly with a Capricorn, a Libra, a Aries, or a Cancer. Okay, you're going to be communicating passionately to this person. I feel like some of y'all didn't match y'all match. Some of y'all are going to be communicating possibly about a child with a Virgo. I told y'all I feel Virgo vibes off of this. Some of y'all have kind of gone within, and I feel like some of y'all have been very analytical about a situation. You don't know where you want to be. You're hanging around in a situation where you're happy, okay, but you're missing a situation where you feel like you can grow. You get what I'm saying? You feel like something's missing. If you could put these people together, you would make the mo the, the, the perfect person, okay? So you think, because, oh, all right, but some of y'all are definitely dealing with a Sagittarius as well, okay? Maybe the Sagittarius has this in and out energy. This person doesn't have the fan power, but this person can be very arrogant about what you do, okay? Some of y'all want to communicate passionately with the Pisces or again the Sagittarius, all right? Or will be receiving communication from this person. Maybe this person left you feeling rejected in the past. 
okay? Or maybe you left this person with you. It's feeling like, why not me? This person is definitely coming back because they feel like it's you that fulfills them. You're their wish. However, you need to communicate about what it is that you feel, okay? As funny as I was saying that, uh, the ace of swords feel. Yeah, you need to communicate about what it is that you feel, you know, because only you can truly be true to what it is that you truly want. And if other people don't fulfill that, you can't. You can't juggle. Some of y'all are going to try to juggle the situation, okay, between two people. Because some of y'all, it's a water sign and an earth sign. Some of y'all are going to try or have been juggling, okay? But you're needing to make a decision. And some some of y'all may want to see making this decision. Or you're not going to want to. But you're needing to choose because someone here truly makes you happy. You definitely met your match. Someone who can definitely balance you out and help you see the beauty in yourself. Some of y'all are already moving independently and you don't, <laughs> you like non-committal and this person has come in and they want to stay. And you're like, what am I going to do? For some of y'all, you're definitely juggling two soulmates. It could be a Leo as well as a water sign as well. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, but strong emphasis on that Leo. All right. <clears throat> Yeah, some of y'all were in a three party situation in the past and you want to move forward to you want to move forward past that. You want to charge in passionately because whoever this is that's charging in or you charging into them, especially if it's a fire energy, y'all very passionate about one another. The passion's definitely there, okay? And you can move forward with the passion, but the communication there you feel like it's childlike. You feel like you kind of you're being temperamental with this person. You you're being patient, okay? And you have a lot of love for this person. However, this person kind of makes you kind of go within, you know. And even though you want to hang in that situation, this could definitely be about this Aries as well. You're having to be honest and truthful to yourself. You're, you're definitely going to be communicating with the fire sign. I do see that between this time. Some of y'all, you're going to be communicating that I love you, but hey, I need to move forward. Moving forward is going to be my best option my best choice for myself in order for me to be happy. But some of y'all are moving forward towards a family situation. Some of y'all are being patient, waiting on something come, to come in that you're passionate about. It could be about finances. It could be about, um, it could definitely be about paternity results as well. Some of y'all are dealing with paternity issues with a Virgo, okay, through the justice system. And the justice will be in your favor, okay? Whatever outcome that you're looking forward to hearing, some of y'all definitely will be walking out of the courtroom looking real good but some of y'all somebody that you have children with this could be a water sign as well they're feeling rejected by you right now like they feel like you're hanging in there with the situation but maybe you're not communicating or maybe they're not communicating with you some of y'all have a Sagittarius that you're being very defensive towards you're keeping your guard up towards this person even though this is somebody who you really love and you really want to work it out with uh this person can be very arrogant sometimes they they communicate and they always got their damn swords out some of y'all y'all very passionate looking back you passionately looking back at the past uh regarding an Aries and you wanting to be truthful to yourself and that person that could be this person here I love you and I want to move forward with you and some of y'all is going to be moving forward away from this person but you want to move forward with them some of y'all is definitely a leo or a sag some of y'all are ending a karmic cycle coming out of a karmic cycle coming out of a cycle where you weren't communicating what it is that you feel not that you've embraced that self-love and being by yourself and really kind of learning how to be truthful to yourself you're really moving in a new space where you wanted to communicate everything that it is that you're feeling you've healed okay some of y'all will still be going through some healing during the first of the 15th okay during this heal some of y'all are healing from a situation when you find out that somebody was juggling you this could have to do with a libra as well but some of y'all you've been defensive towards the family situation when really the most high god your angel spirit whatever you want to call the universe whatever you want to call um you know your spiritual preference they are really assisting you to move forward in this family situation okay because Scorpio, y'all love children. Children and animals always get a fair pass because they can do no wrong. They don't lie. They won't do anything to deceive you. You love the pureness of life, the pureness of anything that can offer you that pureness. Older people, children, you get what I'm saying? Animals, y'all love that, all right? Yeah, definitely. A lot of y'all are going to be walking away. Some of y'all are dealing with another Scorpio, but some of y'all are going to be walking away from something that's someone that you're very passionate about to move towards someone else or a certain situation that you're passionate about. You learned a lot from this person, whoever this is, okay? Some of y'all um, are kind of evening out the karmic skills with a Virgo, but a lot of y'all are going to move forward by y'all self during the first to the 15th towards your money and you're moving forward abundantly okay and you're going to be moving forward towards the things that you're passionate about okay you're possibly turning your back on the fire on one fire sign and moving to 
another fire sign. That blood moon that came about, that blood moon did something different for my Scorpios. A lot of y'all found out that somebody was pregnant during that time. It could definitely be an earth sign. And this person was trying to offer you, this person was trying to offer you a new beginning anyway, but then y'all find out that this person is pregnant. And I feel like some of y'all kept it a secret, okay? But now you want to work on a relationship, all right? But you're leaving somebody out in the cold and somebody you haven't given them clarity or maybe you don't have clarity of this situation, okay? But the outcome is somebody is definitely going to feel betrayed, okay? Could also have to do with a tourist. Maybe somebody was holding on to you or you was holding on to somebody due to financial reasons. But honestly, letting this, letting this situation go, whoever this applies to is actually going to bring your life back balance. But you're having to make a choice, okay? Because it's definitely two other people that you're interested in. For some of y'all, it could be three people, but you're going to be moving towards either air, earth, all the elements are here. Whatever situation is your situation as far as the signs, but the actual situation in itself Take it how it resonates, baby. But I see very clearly, and definitely y'all going to have to be making a decision. But some of y'all is going to move away and be by your damn self. But do what it is that makes you happy. What are you passionate about, baby? It's your world. Know that. All right? Period. Dot. Stamped. Sealed. Delivered. It's your world. I love y'all. Until the 15th. To the 30th. How many days is it in August? 31st? I don't damn know. I, ain't, I, ain't a, I don't watch calendars. <laughs> but yes, until then, my loves. Love y'all.